Oh, it's a video story? <laughs> <laughs> you clicked and it hit the space bar. Hey, we're doing the third part of chapter two. Oh, wait. Uh, we're doing third chapter, chapter of mission two. God damn it. This is confusing. All right. Public building. Public building in the Russian embassy. This last bit. Uh, this is... We, this was a lot easier than it probably should have been. I don't know if we got lucky or what. So we're going to walk out of here first. Jeff's going to snap this guy's neck. And he's like, oh, oh, not fun. Suck it. And then we're going to jump guy. around the outside here. And there's two more bad guys that we have to worry about in this little area. They're right in front of us there. Jeff walked past them. And I'm going to go ahead and mark them. By the bink, way, uh, I don't know if you saw, but there was a dude up on the second floor there. Ignore that guy. Yeah, he's he not going to. He will draw a ton of attention if you kill him. So we just marked, marked and executed those two dudes. Now we're going to run over here. And uh, get in the shadow, and we're actually going to jump down and hang off the side of the ledge here. This is, I don't know how I convinced you not to kill these guys, <laughs> but somehow you didn't. So we're going to jump on this ledge here and then start sliding to our right. You've got to be careful because there's actually lasers on that little walkway right in front of us there. See, this guy's working on a laser, but we're missing him because we're on the outside ledge. That guy's a laser technician. <laughs> he is. He's, he's Microsoft certified laser technician. So we're going to jump around, and look, we leave those three guys be. Oh, how nice is that? What do you think they did in a previous life to deserve not being murdered? That's a good question, Jack. I yeah. don't know the answer. You know, I gotta say, this is uh, probably the easiest of all the missions we've done. Uh, yeah, all, both of them. <laughs> like, all both. We've of them. completed two of them. I mean, out of all the chapters. All right, so this one's a little trickier. So there's a guy on the left there, up on that upper ledge. You have to be careful about him because he's got a good view of the lower area, and so he actually kind of he got me once because there's this guy here by the rail that you have to worry about. So Jeff actually is going to shoot that dude in the head who's up on that second level right there. Oh. Bink. And so now that guy's not he's not there anymore, so when this guy turns his back, I can run around and sneak behind him. So watch this. He's going to go, oh, that way. So I book it, and then I jump over this rail, and now I'm back in the shadow, and that guy completely missed me. And so he thinks he's all safe and stuff, when really he's not safe. <laughs> is that how it works? <laughs> yeah. He's like, man, I'm safe. I'm going to stand next to this rail. Oh, no! Does that guy have a gold chain on <laughs> and a turtleneck? Man, he deserved to die. He's a mafioso. Well, so uh, you got to keep out for, keep an eye out for the lasers there. Uh, Jeff's actually missing one right now, but um, they are all over this map. So I went around the side because I'm smart. And I did the dumb thing. And you went uh, headlong into a group of enemies. So Jeff walked around the, the side here, and the guy's like, hey, what's up? I see you. And he starts firing at him. And, of course, that sets everybody off, and everyone's freaking out. And now I'm sitting there going, why are all these dudes firing at us? <laughs> because I haven't touched anything. Where did Jeff go? And, yeah, well, and now you're what are you going to do? Nightmare. We all make little mistakes here and there. <laughs> so now you're running around trying to catch up to me. Of course, now we've got like three or four dudes running around with flashlights trying to find us. So we take a few more of them out. Bink. Oh, that like it hurt. Right through the temple. No, the temple is the least painful of headshots. <laughs> is, that, is that how that works? I think so the path of least resistance because it's flat good to know i don't know we should do a survey <laughs> if you've been shot in the temple let us know all right so uh the object of this one is get up to this high point here and drop some um the, what are those beacons or something sure why not there's some sort of beacons that alerts the helicopter that you are safe so we're gonna run up here and i'm gonna show you my secret spot so i walk up here your spot sucks compared to mine oh uh, bite me so i'm gonna drop my little thingy drop my strobe there it is now i'm gonna run down the side of this building and there's actually a staircase right there it's kind of hard to see but it, i promise you it's right there and i'm gonna get underneath this staircase as soon as i drop down and so this is my hiding spot now jeff he runs past my staircase around this corner here and into this room, which is a dead-end room, so it's probably not a bad idea, and you cannot shoot out that light, so you are not in shadow. But they, every time we played it, they never come into this room. Probably because I distracted them. Well, I don't think that's the case. No? Oh, well, maybe I'll give it a shot next time. So uh, now you have to stay here for, I think, one minute? Is that what it is? Or 90 seconds? Sure. And, uh, and you know, not let them kill you before the helicopter shows up. So uh, here I am hiding, and then this guy spots me. I quickly mark him, and then I execute him. So he, no, he saw me, but, you know, he's dead, so it doesn't matter. Meanwhile, I'm bored. I mean, yeah, you're just, you're because... just chilling. And then someone threw a frag at me. That's not good. So I moved, and I hide over here. Your spot doesn't seem that safe to me, Jack. Hey, I'm not dead yet. <laughs> <laughs> and so you can see time passes by. We're down to about 10 seconds. One dude walks down the stairs. I took oh, care of him. Nice shot. Thank you. And then now the helicopter should be arriving. The clock has run out. So I look up. I can see the helicopter coming. I'll wait and make sure it's all the way down before I jump up. So as soon as I know I'm going to be able to get to it and be extracted, I then pop up and uh, head towards the helicopter. Now this is you heading towards me, taking your sweet time. I do my best. And there we go. So now I'm going to jump up. And then you're behind me. You jump up. 
this and then get over and then you have to look at the helicopter point up at the helicopter and there's a little thing it'll turn white hit a once it does and then jeff has the, the longest time <laughs> trying to get onto the helicopter clearly not seeing the little icon just jumping back and forth like an idiot uh, uh now detecting there, there we go we extract go. and we grab hands and we do the uh, the thing from true lies and you're my jamie lee curtis oh thanks and where's tia career in my dreams. Aww.